everyone. I'm BPD and we are back in Divine Journey. As you can see, things have changed up a little bit. I said I was going to do a little bit of redecorating and I have done just that. We knocked down our old uh, starter house here. Um, made a little bit of opening for the case. And I put a layer of cobblestone on the ground to stop those freaking pumpkin spiders from spawning inside our base. Because it's been driving me a little bit crazy. Not going to lie to you. Um, but I hope that does that. Our ender lilies are still going. I was going to take those out, but they take a long time to grow and they already had some progress. So I'm going to let them finish up before I, uh, before I move them. Anyway, uh, I don't think I've done much else. I went back into the nether after our last little venture because I realized I didn't get any soul sand, but we got some now almost two stacks just in case we need to make some solarium. So think you're all caught up. We're good to go. Today, we are going to be getting into applied energistics. So I've got the uh, inscribers set up. So those are good to go. Got the charger just in case I need it. Um, hello. My cat has just jumped up to say hello. Hello, kitty. I'm sorry, but you can't hang out here right now. Okay. You got to go. Thank you. You're so pretty, but got to go. Anyway, sorry about that. Um, we got our inscribers set up. We're good to go. Now we just need to get into it. So the first thing I was thinking was, let's go ahead and make a drive, right? Let's do that. That'd be great. No, 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 that's not great. That thing is ridiculously complicated to make. So here's that, right? Okay, well, that looks simple enough. Pressure plates, that's cool. But then it gets into this, okay? A storehouse, right? So you got to make titanium ingots. You got to get all this stuff. This is emerald, uh, vibrant alloy, solarium. Good thing I got soul sand. Um... And then it goes into more complicated stuff. Like, it just gets so complicated. we got to use the item fabricator. So, thankfully, I didn't jump right into that because I was going to. We're not going to be doing that today. We're going to be doing the basics of AE2. We're going to get a controller. We're going to get a couple ME chests going. And we're going to see if we have enough time to get maybe some... Uh, well, actually, no. We probably want to do auto-crafting because we probably want to have a drive for auto-crafting. Um... But the next episode, we're going to try to do the drive, and that it requires teleportation, or that requires going to a land that I've never been to before. I'm not really going to spoil it, but yeah, so that should be fun. Hopefully, we'll get into that next episode, but that's the next episode. This is this episode. So basically, what we're going to do is we're going to kind of go through here and try to complete all the ones we can. We're going to get a controller. We're going to do all of our circuits here. We're going to do ME chests for now, probably two of them. Uh, yeah, two of them should be good, and that'll hold all the junk we have now until we can get drives. So, with that being said, let's go ahead and jump into this. So, the first thing we're going to need is, okay, so this requires pure fluid seed. Drop a fluid seed made from fluid dust and sand into a puddle of water. So, where is fluid dust? There we go, and this is made uh, from just pulverizing a fluid crystal. So... For that, we need, oh, so the one thing that we might end up having a problem with is we have almost no Certus Quartz. So hopefully I don't have to cut in the middle of this to go get more Certus Quartz because that would be unfortunate. Is this charged? No. Charge. Go. Charge. Why are you not charging? Hurry. Can you, there we go. Jeez, that took a long time, didn't it? There we go. Come on. Keep them coming. Come on. Jeez. All right, so we're going to do six of these, I think. Mm, that'll get us 12 Fluix crystals. All right, I think that should be good for now. Maybe we might have to do more. This whole doing things manually, oh, man. I I can't. I need to get out of this phase as quickly as possible. This is just... Too brutal. All right. Um. So we got that. We need nether quartz. So we'll grab a stack of that. We need some redstone. We'll grab a stack of that. Um. And we'll do this. One, two, three, four. Oh, you can't do that. One, two, three, four, five, six. And uh, actually, we'll put it there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Go, go, go. Thank you. And we'll take all that. Okay, now this has to be pulverized. Let's go ahead and run over to our pulverizer over here. Make sure it's not spitting anything out where it doesn't need to. There we go. And we're just going to pulverize uh, half of it. 
And then this is used for what? Okay, sand. We have sand, plenty of sand. Off go. All right. And sand. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. And we'll put those together. And then we'll drop these. So I don't, I hope these growth accelerators are actually working, but I don't know if they are. Hmm. That's gonna, I feel like this is gonna take a while. These ones usually always take a while. And I don't know if these growth accelerators are working. So, yeah. All right, well, let's see what else we can do. We need uh, an ME controller. Okay, so we're working on that. We need a Futuro block, which is blocks, stone, and a redstone. Okay, let's see if we got that. Uh, we have the stone. Oh, we have some blocks, but not enough. Sad day. I'll do this and there. Nope. There we go. And we're going to grab one of these. There we go. Now we'll make a future. Oh, we didn't need to grab the one redstone. Silly me. Nope. And I think it was like this and like this. There we go. Um, what else? We need, okay, processors. So for this, we need to put some diamonds in the engineering processor and some silicon in the silicon processor. So we need two diamonds. How many do we have? 32. That's actually a pretty good amount. Pretty good amount. All right, and then two silicon as well. And we have redstone. So let's go ahead and jump over here. Uh, actually, we do need to put each of these in. Calculation is fine. It doesn't really matter where they go right now because it's not automated. So we'll put our diamond in there and we'll put our silicon in there. There's one. And thank you. And another one. Oh, we should have made one more inscriber. Uh, well, it's fine. It's fine. Do this, and then it goes this, this, and this. Yeah, all right. I do remember things sometimes, very rarely. Three, and that's going to get us two of these. And actually, that should complete a quest for us. So let's go ahead and check that out. So the quest rewards for this, man, are so random. Slime balls for diamonds? How is that an equal reward? How? And you know what you get for more? More slime balls. This is gelatinous slime. I don't know if that's any better, but really? Slime? For diamonds? That's, that's, that's some cold stuff to buy an RPG. That's some cold stuff, man. That is an unfair trade. All right, let's look to see how our crystals are going over here. Uh, they're, they're still babies. They're still little babies. Man, I wish I knew how things worked. Yeah. I, I really did, but that's that's going at least. All right, let's go ahead and prep stuff for a chest. So we need some quartz glass, uh, some emmy cables. We have the flukes crystal, and we need one of these, a terminal. Okay, so for a terminal, we need this stuff, which is tin, silver, and glowstone. Okay, we have tin. We have silver. Ooh, not a lot of silver, though. Not a lot of silver, and we have some glowstone. So let's go ahead, and we get four, I think, for each one. And we need how much for this? We need four. Okay, so we only need to do this one time. One, two, three. Are you on alloys only? Yes. And one silver. One, two, three, four. Oh, of course, I just throw it on the ground. All right, one, two, three, four. There we go. And that should get going. I think it takes a while. Yeah, it takes 32,000 RF to make that. So that's 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 going to be going for a little bit. Uh, glass cable. We need this stuff, which is... Uh, we need to pulverize up some quartz here. So we'll do half a stack of nether quartz pulverized. I don't think I have... Oh, nighttime. Nighttime. We have walls, but I'm still afraid. Still very, very afraid. Okay. Do we have any pulverized quartz, though? 
That's sugar. That's not pulverized quartz. Okay. Doesn't look like we do. That's just fine. How are these going? I really would just want these to be finished. Could you hurry up? Do they look bigger to you? Or are they still little babies? I think they're still little babies. Oh, man. That's going to take a while. I can feel it. Those growth accelerators are not working correctly because I do not know what I'm doing. You know what? Mm, I'll wait. I'll wait. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, so I need glass as well. I should have grabbed that while I was over here. Well, actually, my crafting bench is over here, too. There's no glass in there. Is there glass in there? There sure is. Okay. So for this, we need some quartz glass, of course. Uh, we need this bright illuminated panel. Okay. We need more. Okay, so we do need more of that. We need some quartz glass, and we need invar, which we have, and redstone alloy. So quartz glass is easy enough. One, two, three, four, five, and we'll do two, I think, because it makes like four or something, right? Yeah. So that should be good for now. Uh, do we have redstone? Yes, we do. My inventory is a mess. Let's go ahead and get rid of our slime because that's just super useful. Super useful. Okay, can't get rid of anything else. Um, what was I looking for? Oh, we got the redstone alloy. We need some invar. So with that, we can make one of these fancy panels here. There we go. What? Oh, we don't have our other stuff. Is it done? I think it's done at least. Oh, cool. Look at that. Okay, so one, two, three. One, and one, two, three, four. There we go. All right, so now let's go make some stuffs. And... There, there, there. Oh, look at that. First try. Okay, so we'll grab one of those. Mm, what else do we need? Uh, we need some of these gold ones, so let's grab... Oh, jeez. I have, like, no inventory space, Ming. Uh, what do I... What kind of circuit is this? I don't think that's the one I need. What is... Logic calculation. I am holding a logic, aren't I? Yes, I am. Okay, so we need two of these, uh, which means we need more silicon as well. I should have just grabbed all my silicon. Um, there you go. And the silicon one is here, yep. Take, uh, there we go. I am just so full of garbage right now. So full of garbage. What can I put away? Um, let's see here. Probably don't need that or that or that or that or this or... Mm, that should give me plenty of room. There we go. And... Put you in there. And... We are going to grab both of you. And you go here, here, and here. And then we'll take that. And here, here, and there. Good, good. We're getting there. This is this is tedious stuff, for sure. I mean, this crafting has gotten so much more intense. Uh, my mouse was like not wanting to move. All right. Um. Oh, we need these things now. So I need a gold, again, and another gold. Okay, and another charge, another court, or charge quartz. So let's run back over here. Logic, silicon, and uh, let's go ahead and charge one of these. Uh, silicon, logic. Is that charged? Yes. Okay, good. Don't need that. Need this and need this. We go in here. One two, three, go, 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 and three, come out, beautiful, okay, we're getting places, we're going places, how is this stuff going, oh, my word, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look into that right after I get done building this, uh, 
chest. I think we're going to be able to complete it. Nope. Let's do this. Uh, what? Try again. Oh, I don't have Fluix Dust. Oh. Need two of it. Mm, one, two. Oh, dang it. One, two. Okay, there we go. There we go. Uh, now I can just do... It's going to be one Nether Quartz. Fluix Dust and Redstone? No. Processor. So that's going to get me that, and then we get it charged for this one. Okay. Beautiful. You, us you usually get two for making those in the regular recipe, but now they only give you one. And now we should be, yes, there we go. And the last piece of the puzzle, we need to do this and this. That's what we want. And then a little bit of this action. There we go. Now we can do this. We need dark steel, which we have. I made a bunch of that in preparation for something. I don't think it was actually in preparation for this, but nevertheless, we have an ME chest. That, whoo, that was something, wasn't it? All right, um, now that we've got that, I need to look at what's going on with these crystals here because we really, really, really need these to make this controller. Yeah, you can't use the other other crystals. So, how are these doing? Let's go ahead and jump. It should give us like progress. No. No, it doesn't at all. Okay, well that's cool. Let's go ahead and grab our water. Um hmm. Yeah, grab our water. We'll put it back and I'm going to grab these. Okay, so we have our crystal growth accelerators, um, which I'll just run over. And I'm going to put them closer to the power real quick, like right here. Yeah, I'll just put it right here. Uh, that's where the water will go. So we'll do this, 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 and this. Now you guys, one, two, three, four, and... Five, where are you? There you go. And then we'll grab our water bucket. Okay. And let's try to connect power here, which I don't know. I've tried, I think I tried it and it didn't work. Yeah, it doesn't want to connect to the power anywhere. Maybe the top? No. Hmm. So that's not how it works. Oh. Um. Oh man, I'm just throwing stuff all over the place. Okay. Inventory is out of control. I'm just gonna put some of this stuff in like that. There we go. Let me get all this stuff back. Jeez, so much more difficult. Uh, there and there. So they don't connect to power. They don't connect to these. They do connect to these. Oh man, do I need a energy acceptor? And dirium ingot. Mm, I need pyrothium dust. Huh. Can I make, I, I think I can make one of those. I have the blaze powder, but we are running close on time here. So I think I'm going to get the energy acceptors going. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to, I'm going to cut. I'm going to make this energy acceptor. Uh, it's not too difficult. It's just kind of tedious. I'm just going to do it in the alloy smelter. Uh, yeah, I'm going to do it in the alloy smelter. I have some shiny ingots. There we go. Pulverized shiny metal. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And then, uh, do I have enough? Uh, how many do you get from, okay, you get four. Yeah, I do. All right. Anyway, I'm going to do that and I'll see you when we get the controller, uh, the stuff for the controller ready. I'm going to do the seeds and everything too. So see you in a bit. 
All right, we're back and the pure flux crystals are done. It actually went a lot quicker than I thought it would, but this is the kind of system I had to make because they only take power from the back end right there. And then it also, that has to be pointing in towards the crystals. So it was kind of a, an ugly setup, but it's the best I could do for now. We won't need those, I don't think. Is there the growth chamber in this one? Oh, that would be awesome. Uh, no. Dang it. That, okay, that would have been awesome. Uh, yeah, no. Oh, well. Anyway, um, so we got the pure flux crystals. We can now make our controller. I also made a 1K storage drive uh, in the meantime because it was the easiest one to make, and we're just going to get this uh, started simple. We're going to have drives uh, in the next episode, hopefully, like I said, if we can get into the, the new dimension. But anyway... Uh, we need a controller. I like that it takes these future, uh, Futura blocks. I think that's pretty interesting. All right, uh, we should, oh, we need to smelt. The last part that I forgot to do is smelting some of this sky stone. All right, into the furnace you go. We just need four. So, one. Two, counting with BPD, you gotta love it. Three, four, and that's as high as I can count. There we go. All right, finishing up. Got it, done. There we go. You know what's actually unfortunate is I made this energy acceptor for no reason, essentially. Just to speed up the process, but now I'm gonna have an ME controller, which is gonna be able to provide energy to everything. So that was wasteful, don't do that. If you're me, like, if you're doing this, I would suggest you just wait for the crystals because the amount of stuff that you use to make one of these energy acceptors is actually a lot. So yeah. All right, so we're just gonna set this bad boy up. Uh, hmm. We'll do it, we'll just do it right here for now. Mm. No, I really want it to be out of the way. So we're gonna do this. I have some cables already. There you go. Oh, I don't need to do that anymore. I have the right click. I always forget, I'm used to playing Feed the Beast Beyond where you don't have the Tinker's Construct right click because you have the offhand thing, which I hate so much. Uh, but anyway, that's beside the point. It was random. So this goes down like this, and then you go like this, and there you go. Right? Oh, man, don't tell me. Okay, no, 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 that's right. Why aren't you getting power? Enemy controller zero out of 11. What? What kind of... Oh, there's no power in here. Okay, we turn you on. Activate. Yeah, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. I was like, oh, maybe I am going to need the energy acceptor. But no, I don't. I just That just cements the fact that I do not need. That I wasted endearium and blah, blah, blah. Anyway, I don't want to talk about it. I just don't want to talk about it. All right. What we do need now to finish up the whole process is our ME chest and our uh, dealie right here. So we can just throw this down. Give it one of these bad boys, and we now have a storage system. Yay! So much work for uh, for all that. I had to say so much harder than regular uh, applied energistics, but it's okay. It's all worth it. Is this not getting power right now? It's like using up all the power. Very interesting. I'm producing. 1,000 RF per tick. Well, that's... Oh, it's charging up this battery, though, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Anyway. Oh, night time. That is going to do it for us. Um, I feel accomplished. I'm going to move everything, all the important stuff anyway, uh, like ores, the things we have a lot of, ores, wood, cobblestone, stuff like that. I'm going to move it into the ME chest in between now and the next episode and do a little bit of research and prepare. We don't have to go far in this new ice world. It's pretty much kind of like what we did with the nether. We just have to pop in steal some bricks and then leave. So we'll probably end up doing that so we can get a drive because I don't want to live off these ME chests. Like having one is more than enough. 
I can use this. I even had one in my setup on Feed the Beast Beyond. It's good for holding the cobble for a cobble gen. Other than that, pretty useless. So uh, I want to get rid of that as soon as possible. Not as useless as this energy acceptor. Once again, don't make this. Don't be like me. I did bad things. Don't do that. It's a waste. Like, such a huge waste. I'm so, so disappointed. But anyway, thank you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed it. I know I definitely did, even though even though that energy acceptor exists. Uh, maybe we can uncraft it later. But, uh, yeah. That's it. I don't have anything else to say, and I feel like I'm rambling. So, uh, bye. Till I see you again. Have a good one.